What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Roy Kavidi. I'm back with another video. Today, we're going to be going over the SMC versus Oxnard game. As you guys can see, the first goal, they got right off a set piece near the 20. We went marking the man, and the guy gets a little header, hits it towards the back post. And uh, this is my first touch of the game. You guys see, I just, you know, played defensively and just pass it to L. That was my first clearance. As you guys can see, I just cleared the ball. From the corner kick, we get a little foul for Taj. Way to keep the ball, use his body to go in front of the ball. Here, Elvis gets the ball, finds me. I see like Kyler's wide open. I play Kyler and open up for him again, just in case if he wanted to play me the ball again. But he decides to go to Marcus, which was a good idea. Over here, we're trying to organize another press. As I see, see everyone's got their man very, very close to each other. This guy in the middle is a little bit open, but Marcus steps up pretty nicely. And I get a little touch on it. Taj uh, gets pressed really quickly. Didn't really have much to do, maybe like a little dribble, but gets a little bit unlucky in the dribble. Over here, another clearance on my part. You know, just shifting in, marking my man, getting in front of him to clear the ball. Here I get the ball. I see that the situation's a little bit tight and I know Connor's gonna clear it, but I just decided to do it myself. The numbers were pretty, pretty high on our side and I feel like uh, I would rather play the 50-50 ball uh, up front. Yeah, over here we played defensively, Connor one-on-one, -on -one, plays really well, and um, I get the ball, I dribble towards the middle, I notice a three-on-three, -three. I'm just trying to use my speed, dribble towards the middle, Jay and uh, Taj, or that's Alex, in the width, great run from Jay, a beautiful finish as well, I like to chip over, but unfortunately the defender gets in front of the ball, I was also there for the back pass, just in case if he wanted to play me back, and I could have taken a touch and finished, but um, he decided to shoot, which was a good idea as well, but um, yeah, over here, I just use my body. I get a little foul and I just quick play to Kyler because I want to get the ball moving. Here, they got a free kick. I wanted to talk about this free kick because I actually think the idea behind it was really good. As you guys can see, the they create a little lane between both of them and the, the shooter just like tries to play him like towards the six for our side. I feel like that's a very strategic play. I really liked it. That's for anyone else that's playing, you know, next time against them. That's one of their plays. Over here, I get a little shot. I should have hit it with more power towards the back post. The The accuracy was good. I feel like more power on it so the so I could challenge the goalie. And I feel like it would have been good. Over there, I just played a defensive play and cleared the ball. It's my second touch of the first half, or my first touch of the second half. Get the ball in the middle over here. I noticed that Kyler's man marked, so I just play Alvin on that width. I feel like he should have been a little bit higher maybe towards the 50 to get the ball but yeah i get the ball here just trying to find players connor finally checks in and he plays me very early here i got the ball towards the middle i play connor again connor plays me and i notice that the, that side is just so free so i play um javi out there but we decide to chip it i feel like we could have dribbled or done something more dangerous but I understand that you know we had a couple numbers in the box try to hit it towards the middle so the idea behind it was good but i feel like javi's dribbling is very good so he can dribble players and stuff here we get a nice little press with connor i feel like we should have taken it there but a little bit unlucky connor's amazing way to back press and get the ball here i get the ball i play uh, alex but it gets between his legs should have played him a softer ball maybe something like you know easier to control here, um, Alvin gets dispossessed. They get a nice little move, uh, offensive move. They got a 3v2. The guy dribbled towards the middle and hits it from post. Pretty nice play on their part. That was a good goal on their, on their, on their part. Here, I get the ball. I just play Kyler because I see he has time. He can dribble the ball up and I can create space for him. So I just play him the ball over there. Here, I just, you know, way to keep the ball just like moving it trying to build up and stuff i can't really see anything open so i just play it back to kyler here i get a little touch i feel like i should have taken it with you know full 100 percent but we managed to get the ball with Jaime. great defense on his part here as you guys can see we're tracking back kind of i'm trying to get like the, the guy on the back post but they, he just dribbled the guy uh dribbles towards the middle and finishes Here, I'm trying to step up, win the first ball. I challenge the 50-50 and get it. 
Hodge gets the ball. And um, unfortunately, we didn't get the second ball. Yeah, here, I'm just trying to trying to see what they're giving me. They're not giving me anything. I see that like the midfield was pretty open, so I just played it towards uh, Alvin and I try to build it up. Here, I just get a foul. Here's another great defensive play. As you can see, I track back. Boom, I get the ball. Get forward. Here, I get the ball towards the middle, but like kind of lofted. So I kind of like chip it over uh, the defender that was pressing me. And Naxal gets the ball, and I just play it back. I feel like over here, I should have just played Alvin, because I see that Alvin had a bunch of space on that left side. But um, yeah, I played David instead. He had time, so I played him. Just reset the whole play. Here I get the ball in the middle. I, I feel like I feel like I should have taken my touch like towards the direction, maybe left or right, so I can expose one of the defenders. When I got the ball, I I had time, but I feel like I should have taken it. I should have taken my touch towards a direction, and you know, combined with one of my players. But yeah, that was one of the mistakes in that play. Here I get the ball in the middle. I just play back to um, Jose. So he gets the ball. And we try to find a little internal play, but they had a, a lot of numbers in the back. Here, I'm just trying to like get the second ball. I use my body very well. Nice little move back here, keep the ball. Then I find out why to, to Jay, and then overlapping run by Jose. Here, Jay gets the ball, he's trying to dribble. He plays it back over here. I see a little gap between both of the defenders. I get the ball, take a touch. And I feel like I should have taken another another touch and exposed one of the defenders. But overall, the play was very nice. I created space for myself, and um, I was also expecting pressure. But you know, it's my it's my responsibility to be looking over my shoulder and checking if anyone's pressing. But uh, I didn't do that. So next time I need to check in over here. I feel like Todd should have played me with his left foot. That little internal pass I could have turned, maybe even even a chip a chip ball behind the line. But um. I feel like if he touched it on one, then it would have been perfect. Especially considering the fact that we had a, such a good press on that side. We pressed very well, we got the ball very high, and I feel like if he just split split us with that one pass, then it would have been completely different. Over here, I use my body very well to you know keep the ball, and then Taj just gets it. But um, we don't complete our pass. Here I get the ball in the middle. I see uh, uh, Jose wide open, so I just play him. He takes the ball up, and I'm creating. I'm trying to create a run, you know, towards the box or something. I feel like here he should have played me right there, right in that little area. If he just tapped it towards my direction, like in front of my leg, in front of my right leg, then I could have driven in and had a 1v1 chance. But um, we took a little bit of a big touch, and it's a little bit unlucky. But over here, I got a little cross in. I feel like the ball that I play in has to be not lofted. It has to be a driven. And in this situation, I lofted the ball. But it was a decent ball. We had a really good chance over there. This is my other cross from the corner. I feel like this one went front post. I should have played it, uh, you know, back post because all the numbers were back there. And yeah, that was the end of the game. My last touch of the game. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Peace out.